around with it all day, who quietly, makes, not letting who, anyone see until. Who makes the demo hardware? This is made by Asus. So let's see how we're doing. So this is the live screen start screen. Just pump it up here. Now, what I want to know is, do you give the users a cue? How can I help you on something? Some more time. Good switching. Okay. Hi. Hi. I'm sorry, Barton. Do you give users a cue on how to unlock it? Yeah. So uh, there's a, a variety of different lock screens that you'll see depending on your circumstance. Like if you're an exchange user and there's a policy in place, you see a number pad, that sort of thing. Oh, with this the basic, you can swipe that lock screen off without any locking, whichever way you want to swipe it. Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm Steve Harris. Hi. So this is the home screen. I know you do. The home screen has all the tiles, and you can see the tiles are alive, they're moving, and you can dive in from this home screen into the hub experiences that Joe showed. I'll show you just a couple of them. This is the people experience, where you can see recent contacts. You can skip through and see your entire list. There's an easy way, actually, to skip to different letters people's names. If you click on a letter, early beta code, caveat, caveat, caveat. <laughs> we'll come back to that. You can see the integrated social feeds. So these are the social feeds of my contacts coming in from Facebook and Twitter so I can see what's up and what's new with them. At any time, there's just these three buttons. I can press start and come back to here. The um, Xbox Hub is a very cool experience. Again, we just announced today Xbox Live is coming to the device. This is a game collection, and I can skip through the experience on the spotlight. New games are out and available. I can skip through and come to live. So this is this device is actually tied to this person named Joe Wilson. This is her avatar, and uh, you can see that that live experience comes through from the Xbox, and then also requests new news. It's your turn to play a particular game to take a turn new games that are coming in games that are suggested to you by your friends and there's also oh pictures up is here let's take a look at pictures up so it's another hub. You can have a gallery, some recent pictures of a family hike, and also, again, the integrated experience where other content feeds are coming in. This is what's new with my friends and pictures that they posted. What do you think? You like it? Can you hold the phone? Sure. We'll build it this way. Just call it a street. And the dial pad. Oops. We don't want to bleed off. The light? Hold on a second. Let's see if I can scroll out okay. of this. Reset. Reset. <laughs> yes, maybe, maybe, maybe. How about there we all, go. How about all the application compatibility? All the applications, the whole application list? Hmm? All you mean all the applications that are on the device? Uh, I mean uh, Compatibility with older compatibility. applications. Older, like uh, Windows Mobile 6 applications. We're not making any announcements today about applications and how they fit, but at the Mix conference, which is happening next month, we're going to deliver a lot more detail on the power of the platform, what you can do with it, the tools that are going to be available, and how to take advantage of them. We have a lot of our best developers coming to that, in addition to the developers that build. Who make this one? This is made by Asus. By? Asus. It's a Asus. prototype Asus. device Asus. made by Asus. Correct. Can you go back into the dot? Into the dialer and show me how I would turn on speakerphone. So early software, that. mostly showing off the hub experiences. Okay. Is the Garmin Asus logo? This is uh, this is made by Zeus, and they are one of the partners that we threw a couple of the hub experiences that are on there. These tiles are alive. You can see they're moving. You can see them change when you miss calls or get new texts or new alerts come in. I'm going to show you the Xbox panorama. We announced today Xbox Live is coming to Windows Phone 7 series, and it's just a great experience. You can skip through, see your collection of devices, new spotlight games that are available, recent requests, and here's the connection back into Live where you see the avatar of the user when they're a live subscriber. Take a look at the People Hub. You can see recent contacts. Again, these styles are alive and their pictures sort of scan through. The complete list of all of the people who are on the phone. 
and the integration of social media connections. So this is what's new, and I can see from my contacts new information that's popping up, new things that they've posted in real time. We've got a bunch of devices working today, and so I was sort of expecting some of my friends to be typing little notes that were making them silly in front of the press, but so far they haven't taken that path, which is great. <laughs> Uh, let's take a look at the pictures hub. So here, just a gallery of pictures. You can see all your pictures here, your favorites. And again, it's a nice experience. You skip through it. See some recent pictures of family hike. And then what's new? So here we've got integrated social media sites where I can see pictures that my friends are posting right in the pictures hub itself. So it's bringing the various components of an experience together into one place in a really compelling and a beautiful way. What do you think? Nice. You like it? May I make you a question?